I'm going to subscribe to Peacock. I'm going to subscribe right now. How about that? I'm just going to do this on air, okay? How about this? Okay, so final update. To watch WrestleMania live April 10th and 11th, you'll need to sign up for Peacock Premium, okay? And with the premium, yeah, here it is. Special offer, Peacock Mania. Use the promo code Peacock Mania. Oh, I wish they called WrestleMania Peacock Mania this year. Um, Peacock. Well, what else am I going to pee out of? All right, Bob, Bob, Bob. Stop it. Stop it right now. And get four months of Peacock Premium for $2.50 a month. Is there any value on the product? They went down by 25%. That's what this is worth now. Oh, sweet mother of pearl. Let me check my emails before this to make sure these idiots haven't, uh, blah, 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 blah. No? Okay. So let's do this right now, okay? I'm going to sign up for Peacock Premium. Uh, enter my pro oh, Peacock Mania. Okay, redeem now. It, the promo just code comes right up from your, your link there. Okay, and there's a picture of Bobby Lashley. Okay, let me move the microphone here because it's in my way. Um... And I have to create an account, okay? So I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you my uh, my email. Who the hell cares? It's Bob Hanson jokes at Gmail. My password. I'm not telling you that. Let's get the fuck out of here. You know who I am? I'm a former world, ta I'm a former WXW tag team champion. Thank you very much. Former San Diego Southern County Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Champion. I'm not just going to tell you my password and the thing. Okay, so create account. Okay. Uh huh. I have a pro oh, there it says again. Uh -huh, okay. I have to re enter it. It's tricky. If you don't re enter it, it goes to the regular uh nine ninety nine a month. Oh, what the hell? I thought it was, uh, was at the five and five. I don't know. See, this thing is let me And then you add in it says invalid invalid promo code. See this doesn't Yeah. Oh, I see. Four months for nine ninety nine. So, it would... okay. So, huh? Interesting. This is complex. I don't really understand. Oh, the password's got to be ten characters. You son of an unnamed goat. Why would you do that to me? Okay. There's one. It's a password I like to use. Okay. And I can't apply it again. I don't understand. Uh, this word create account. They hit a yellow. Cry. My my peacock is being created right now. It says whoops. There's been a problem. Try again. What? Is, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. I don't know, guys. Maybe this was a bad idea to do this in a podcast. You, you shouldn't still be listening to this. I mean, uh, at one point, Bob Squad, I'm going to blame you guys. If re really, why are you encouraging me here? This isn't helping anyone. I'm putting in my address, as they say in the post office. Here's looking up your address, all right? There's my zip code in San Diego, California. A lot of people don't know San Diego um, is actually Spanish for go straight on red. A lot of people don't know that. It's a driving thing. But what happens when the light's green? Oh, they still go straight, but you must also be texting. It's odd how the rules apply. I have to put in my credit card information here. I'm going to read out all the credit card numbers to you guys. Is that cool? Any expiration date? Do you want to... These are the numbers. I can justify this is... Even though I shouldn't be spending this money because I'm basically spending less money since my $10 thing ends today. The little CVV, whatever the hell number it is on the back. Okay, I sniffle into a microphone. Okay, so this should do it. So I'm starting my account right now. Ooh, they have rainbow colors like the peacock. I understand. Okay. Oh, there's AC Slater. There's, uh... Oh, is that like the new Saved by the Bell? Is he's old as fuck here? Timeless Faves. There's Pam from The Office, who we all wanted to make relations with. Because they, that, they see, you think you have a chance, so that's sexy in a way. Comedy series King of Queens. That's a new one with the Scientology lady who, who looks kind of mean, to be honest with you, but she's sexually hot. Something called Powerful Drama. Yellowstone with Kevin Costner. So, uh, huh. So I'm going to start watching. So I'm going to start watching 
Peacock, okay? Let's see. Let's see what's on Peacock. I'm going to verify my email for security purposes, and then I'm going to check that email right now. So they just, they're never going to leave me alone. This was a big mistake. Okay, so I'm home in Peacock. And then right at the top, if you're in Peacock, um, there's a thing and there's uh, some options. Featured movies, TV shows, sports, WWE. Okay, kids, news, Latino. <laughs> Just Latino, whatever. That's like when you're you're shopping and like the, the one aisle is like Latino, Asian, or in New York, Jewish. And it's just like, this is the aisle, just Jewish. This feels a little weird. doesn't feel quite right, but I'm going to let it go because I have no say in the matter. Oh, the fresh new 1999 summer movie American Pie can be viewed where Jason Biggs puts his wiener in a pie, which never made any sense because what didn't he... Uh, Glad they're staying current. So the Nutty Professor, I'm looking at the feature films. You can watch The Nutty Professor. You can watch The Rundown with The Rock. You can watch a documentary on John Wayne Gacy, who was a clown that murdered kids or something like Holy balls, really? Um, best of WWE, okay. Uh, icons, so they have their NXT, their Icons docs, their WrestleMania, their... 50 greatest women stars. Oh, they corporatize the shit out of this. Your Raw. 14 seasons of Raw for the all 14 years has been on TV, I think. Fast Lanes. Total Bellas. You can watch. Oh, God. Oh, no. Yeah, this is just new shit. Uh, I think the Royal Rumble. 34 seasons of Rumble. That makes sense. UK is on here. Okay. Maybe because I had that problem with the UK. I was, um, I'm so, why are you still, I'm so sorry. Why, you, why am I doing this to you? You, you? you could turn this off. I apologize. Let me drink some water. Ms. and Mrs. is on here. Ah, oh, Christ. What about all that old territory stuff? I always said I'd get around to watching, but never do. Where's that? <laughs> 33 years of SummerSlam. Okay, that's fair. So you're, your main WWE pay-per-views, your WrestleMania Rewind, all the shit they made for the network. Oh, there's a view all button. Okay, view all. I'm afraid of this. Um, Ruthless Aggression doc. The Undertaker doc. Anything with The Miz. Still here. All their goofy shows like Talking Smack. The Bump is There it is. The Bump is here. Kayla hosts both of them. She's actually attractive. Uh, the Day Of, The 205 Live, Chronicle, it's all the same shit, Chronicle 24-7, whatever the hell it is, Total Divas, of course, but more Nia Jax, ugh. So basically, only the shit they want you to see is on Peacock. This is sad. This is the saddest shit I've ever seen in my... Uh, this is worse than watching Raw. I think wrestling just died. Ugh. Wrestling's dead. So really, if the if the libraries of all these great companies, and also WCW, LOL, um, if all your ECW, your Smoky Mountain, your Mid-South, your AWA, your Jim Crockett this, your NWA that, your, no, Memphis was never on it, right? I don't think so. Um, Dallas, um, not the program Dallas, but you know, you understand what I'm talking about. Who shot JR? Not the announcer JR. You know what I'm talking about. Fritz and the, and the guys, um, whatever I'm missing, Florida stuff probably, I can't think of anything, you get the idea, it's gone, <laughs> it's over, it's owned by a company who's not going to air it, and if NBC is going to have their rules, and whatever someone who's never seen wrestling before decides is offensive, is not going to air it, uh, which is a different argument. Piper, in 1990, doing his half-body blackface was actually also a bad idea in 1990. Yes, it was. Even then, it was weird. DX doing the blackface thing in 98, which is eight years later, also weird at the time. I don't think you should take the stuff off. Don't kill me. It's... 
for me, I think it's actually kind of more racist to erase it and pretend, hey, we were great guys the whole time. It's kind of dishonest. It's like we're not owning it is kind of the way I is, is actually why I feel creepier about erasing it. It's like we're not owning how shitty we were being. So I think we leave it there and take responsibility for it rather than pretend it never happened, which is really just protecting us and not those marginalized people is how I feel about that. So leave it on. Own your shit and, and do better forward. You can't go backwards in time, whether you want to or not. I'm on Peacock now. Good thing I peed out of my cock before I started this happy horse shit. Ah, okay, wrestling is dead. The more you know.